Hey girls, hey boys. As you can tell by the title, I am doing a New Year's Eve makeup tutorial. I wanted to do something smoky and dark and glittery and glam, something that screams New Year's and this is the look that I came up with. And I'm so excited for the new year because I just, I don't know, I just love New Year's. I just love starting over. It's not really starting over, it's just another day, okay. But, you know, New Year. Not a new me, same me. But I just, my goal for this year is to grow on my channel. And I only have 700 something subscribers, but I wanna hit that thousand mark. And once I hit that thousand mark, it's gonna motivate me even more to continue. So if you can help your girl out, maybe share this video, give this video a thumbs up, just help me get to a thousand, guys. It's kind of far, but it's also kind of close. But yes, I just really wanna grow on this channel. I wanna make a platform, I wanna influence others. I just wanna do what I love, but also help those who want to learn as well not only with just makeup but like everything else like lifestyle everything but yes i'm just gonna be quiet and stop rambling i just wanted to share my 2018 goals and the main goal is to just grow my youtube channel that is my goal so without further ado let's just get right into the tutorial because i'm a beautiful wreck a colorful mess but i'm funny Alright guys, so I tried the new technique of not setting your concealer on your eyes. So I primed my eyelids using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and I did not set them with powder. I just went straight into the eyeshadow and as you can tell, I have all the names of the eyeshadow here. And the eyeshadow palette that I used today is the Morphe 39A palette. And for the main attraction, for the lid, I used my Desi X Katie palette. And as you can tell, I used Turbo Sand all over my lid. For this New Year's look, I wanted to do something smoky, but also having that New Year's glitter. So that's why I felt like Turbo Sand was the perfect shade. And I'm also using Suze as my inner corner highlight, as well as my brow bone highlight. And now I'm going back into the 39A palette to smoke out my lower lash line. And I pretty much used the same exact colors as I did on the crease. And now for the lashes, I use my Vamptress Lashes by Violet Voss. And for mascara, I am using the Their Real Mascara by Benefit, just to exaggerate my lower lash line. Now for bronzer, I'm using the Give Me Sun by MAC. And I'll have all the brushes and products listed down below. Thanks so much. Make sure you subscribe, guys. My beautiful princess. Glory. <laughs> now for the blush, I'm going in with my MAC Melba blush. Of course, what is new? What is new? And to carve out my cheekbones, I am using the MAC and Patrick Star setting powder, which is also amazing. I love it. Now to highlight to the gods, I'm using MAC's Oh Darling highlight as well as Desi X Katie's Fuego highlight. Now, if you want your face to stay on all night, I'm going to set it with the MAC Fix Plus, and this is the lavender scent. It smells so good. Now for the lips, I'm using MAC's Whirl Lip Liner, along with MAC's Velvet Teddy Lipstick. All right, guys, so this is the finished makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I just wanted to do something dark, smoky, but also glittery at the same time, and this is the look that I came up with. And I thought the Desi X Katie palette was perfect because the lid shade's just, it's like dark, but it also has that like, oof, mm, a little like glitter, you know what I mean? Like I said, I cannot believe 2017 is already over. Like, this year flew by so fast, you guys. Where has time gone? We're already in 2018. We're about to be in 2018. That's all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what you'd like to see in the future. Please subscribe, stay blooming, and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.